it's got plenty of tire and plenty of horsepower for uh, you know for speed uh, compared to the NASCAR car, the Thunderbird. The, this car is much quicker through the corner. Uh, it's almost as quick down the straightaway. But where I'm having difficulty is that this car transmits all of its movement in a very linear fashion. There is almost no body roll. So what, what I'm thinking is the car wants to come out of the corner and the left rear dip a bit in the right turn, telling me when to get on the gas and what to do and how to go. This car doesn't do this. This car corner is completely flat. So I've just got to get myself to where I trust the car on the gas coming out of more of the corners. It's easy to do that in five and six. Uh, they're left-hand turns and they've got a slight bank to them at the exit. So it's easy to get more power on. But on the flat right-hand 90 degree turns three and four, that's very difficult. Back in the 80s, Sam Moses, writer for Sports Illustrated, uh, wrote a great book about his year in IMSA racing. And the title said it all, Fast Guys, Rich Guys, and Idiots, was the title. I'm not fast, and I'm not rich, uh, but I'm having a good time.